An Olathe Senior Living Facility has some pretty unique visitors to help with its residents that are dealing with dementia. The Now KC's Ray Daniel shares with us how these robotic pets are keeping residents calm. When you first see them, you almost think they're alive. This what is it? Bella and Benedito. Like this, Bella? They're Paro pets here at Santa Marta Senior Living Facility. There are 100 really? sensors, five different kinds. Um, they react to light, touch, sound, temperature. Um, if you touch posture. These therapeutic medical devices can help calm those who suffer from dementia. Sometimes with dementia, they have behaviors um, wandering, they become agitated, anxious. Um, this will help redirect some of those behaviors. If we set them um, with a paro, they will um, sit more instead of pacing. Um, it decreases their anxiety and it decreases loneliness. So we try to use these when we start seeing behaviors escalating. Miss Florence, who has a family member who suffers from dementia, sees the impact from the seals. You know, residents use them and uh, they're very attached to them. Healthcare leaders hope this can be an alternative before using medication. Medications all have side effects, so trying to use something um, other than medications is definitely more beneficial to the residents. Um, studies have shown there's a 30% decrease um, in the use of antipsychotic medications when we use a PARO. Santa Marta is just one of two facilities using these PARO pets in the state of Kansas. We use them with group activities. We use them one-on-one -on -one, um, with any kind of um, anxiety, depression, those kind of things. Although it's only been a few months of working with these PARO pets, healthcare providers say they plan on implementing these devices long term. In Olathe, Ray Daniel for the Now KC. I don't know if it's just me, but I had to do a double take at first. I thought those were actually real pets.